So I read your guys' comments from the last video regarding the structure of the videos. It seems like a lot of people do like the live commentary style, but also a lot of people do like when the content is a little more uniform, where I'm pausing the videos, reading comments, and explaining the situations and stuff like that. I'm gonna go ahead and try it all. I'll probably just do a mixture one on this video. Your guys' feedback is really cool to see, and it helps a lot. All right, here we are. I think we'll, uh... I think I would be down to do a nice Slayer Fighter build, because I don't really have that much play. Actually, we'll do a mixture. We'll do some plate. We'll go light on the leggings. We could do an agility tunic. How much PDR we got? 19. That's like nothing, man. 21. Actually, here's what I'll do. Okay, we'll do the riveted gloves. But we'll get a nice chest piece. So let's go ahead and get a chest piece. Perhaps a dark plate armor. So that we have a little more movement speed here. We'll go ahead and buy this dark plate armor. Did you say 100 Gs? That's cool, man. Was that 100 all? Yeah, it was 100 G fast. And he gave me six candy. That's very nice of him. We got our chest piece. And it has six armor on it. 31 PDR. What if we did this? 34, 31. We'll go with the 31 since it has two strength on it. And uh, let's go here and put this falchion on. We'll do the three max health and the armor penetration. That's just better than the one that I have right there. That's actually pretty good. The four max health is what makes it up. I mean, the rest kind of aren't good. Actually, I got to hold on to that because I could probably sell it for like 500 Gs. The he we're going to do a health build here. See, this is a health bonus, max health. Who else we got? Got anything good here? This will do. That's fine. Both tatter cloaks that I have are one strength. But this has 1.4% max health bonus and damage, additional damage. We'll take that one, and we're at 130 plus. The three max health, so 133, plus the 1.5% max health bonus. So we're probably at like 135. We're going to go ahead and just buy a 40 damage crossbow here. 15 bolts. And I think we're ready. Let me get a med kit. Got a Slayer fighter right here. Hey, what's up, dude? Man, this fighter is a killer. That guy's a killer, man. The arming sword with fighter. Slayer fighter is insane. At 34 damage, plus 5. I didn't see what other stats he had, actually. What other stats did he have on that sword? <coughs> Health bonus. Physical power. Okay, so our HP is 135 with these on. That's decent. That is decent, indeed. Do you kind of wish that we had some more PDR? And we're going to go ahead and loot a little bit. The reason I want to loot is I need to find some prop potions. So if we can find a potion of protection, that would be very nice. These things are unpredictable, man. What do you what do you do? Oh there we go. Step Yeah, I really need to learn how to dodge every single mob. I gotta learn how to do it. I just haven't gotten around to it. Bro, I hate those things. But they carry, like, some good stuff. Like, sometimes they carry rings. There we go. Prop potion. Oh, perfect timing. 
Perfect timing. Who is it? Bet you it's a rogue. Yeah, he's scared. He's dead. Unfortunately. That's a pretty good ring. I mean, it's not great, but it's better than mine. That sucks for him, man. It wasn't an outplay. He made a mistake. It's on him, though. This guy says, as a fighter main, I would disagree that PDR is broken. If you see a full metal fighter and you rush him thinking that you're going to one-tap him, it's your own fault. Fighter, honestly, is the most well-balanced class at the moment. He can be super resilient to PDR, but the second a warlock hits him with BOC or wizard smites him with lightning strike, basically is toast. The entire premise of the game is building your class, and there will always be a counter to your playstyle. I think this guy makes a really good point. You guys saw how I lost my high PDR build last game to a rogue. You know, a rogue with poison or a wizard with freaking lightning strike. Dude, I had 60 PDR and a warlock freaking hit me once with a crystal sword with BOC. My health went down to 25%. This kind of all goes back to what I usually say, which is this game all comes down to how you play the game, your awareness, your decision making. I would say 80% of it is the person behind the keyboard and that the people who go into general chat and complain generally are very, very tilted. They're tilted and they just lost their whole kit to a PDR fighter because they made a mistake like rushing a PDR fighter and hitting him six times and he's not dying. And then some of you will say, well, of course he's saying that he's a fighter main. I genuinely don't think it matters what class you play. You're analyzing everybody that plays this game, whether it be a wizard, warlock, a rogue. You see how they kill you, you see how they play. But don't worry, I will be exploring other classes, just not yet. I run into the most OP bards. Not barb, bards. B-A-R-D. Like, when they are fully buffed, and they have, like, a rapier, and they're fully geared, dude, it's so hard to kill them. Like, it's it's so difficult. Like, I almost always lose to a bard. That, a good bard. We got second wind. We're fine. I don't think this guy can win. He, I think he's undergeared. He's gonna drink some alcohol though. You know what? I'm just gonna kill him. That's fine. The only problem is, is if this guy... That no, sounds like a rogue. I think that's a rogue. It's a Slayer Fighter. Wait, we win these. We win those because we're PDR. Because we might not have a port. Well, actually, we probably do. Leather cap for when I do Slayer. Better than mine. Bank. Money. Can't go wrong with money. Take the surges. Take the campfire. I'm good. Let's get out, dude. <coughs> no, I'm the only one. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to run the PDR build in a duo situation, 1v2s. We're going to see how it goes. If I lose this kit, it's fine. Uh, PDR builds are a lot more fun in High Roller, I must say. So here we go. Let's go ahead and do some ruins. This guy said the game will be fine. It's an alpha testing right now, and they're still adding more content. Once there is more repeatable gameplay loop and more stuff other than the only PvP you'll see, more people come back. That being said, cheaters, RMT, are ruining the game like with any game. I think last video people were a little confused when I said the game was dying. The only reason I say that is because of the player count. It used to be so much higher, and now it's kind of like at five, to 10,000, which I just found out that that's actually pretty decent for a game. I think that would be in like the top 100 of Steam if a player base had five to 10,000 people playing it. I could be wrong on that. I just read somebody's comment who said that. I think I got general chat syndrome. I actually completely stopped reading general chat. I quit, like I quit general chat. I'm done reading it. I'm done getting involved with it because the people there are just way too negative kind of terrible. And during that time, I was reading general chat and everybody was saying the game is dying, the game is screwed, blah, 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 all that stuff. We always have to remember that the game is just not done yet. As soon as they put the game on a bigger platform, I think it's going to get a lot more attraction. Cheaters, RMTs, yes, they are ruining the game. It does happen in a lot of games. 
just it's kind of crazy how people found a way to make a living you know cheating and darker and darker maybe not a living but you can certainly make some money cheating highly not recommended if you care about the state of the game because the people cheating in crips high roller most certainly is ruining the game i've seen a lot of small content creators leave the game and they stopped playing dark and darker as a whole because of the cheaters Luckily for me, I mostly do solo play, so I'm not really involved in the crypt scene and the crypt high roller scene. Apparently that's where all of the hacking happens. At least in all the hours that I've put into this game, I've never ran into any hackers in normal GC, high roller GC, ruins, normal crypts. It's all high roller crypts from what I hear, since that has like the best loot. You gotta remember, this is an amazing idea what these developers have came up with. So you better bet that there's another company right now, as we're speaking, making a game just like this, and even better. But I hope this one is the one that thrives the most. The amount of dopamine that I still receive from this game after even thousands of hours of playing it, it's incredible. Wait, they are. They are that way. It's a ranger. BOC, BOC, BOC. How is he not dead? How is that guy not dead? No, we dip, we dip, we dip, we dip. How was that warlock not dead, dude? That's actually kind of crazy. That door sh- No, that door's open. I thought that door shut. Now, ideally, we want a campfire here. Ideally. I hit that warlock twice. And I hit him with the crossbow. Oh. Can we get away with this? I think we get away with this. I don't think they saw me. Maybe they did. Maybe they did. If I die, so be it. So be it. We're gonna kill the team on our right. I think it was a ranger and I didn't see what the other dude was. Okay, there's a team over here, too. Dude, I killed the Slayer Did I kill the Slayer Fighter? No, the Hunting Trap killed him. Okay, now these two guys were yoked. The Slayer Fighter and the Swarlock. These guys were absolutely yoked. Let's see what happens. No shot, he killed him. He killed the warlock that I was trying to kill. This dude is insane. That was a really good fight. That was a really, really good fight. And yeah, so that Slayer Fighter, man, that guy hit really hard. Dude, damage bonus and physical power. How, how many hits did it take me to kill that fighter? Maybe three? Three hits? I think one headshot, two body shots. That was crazy, dude. That was crazy. Very, very cool. Alright, let's see what we can do here.